Let's check in this morning with Tom Brandon. He is live out in West Little Rock at Pulaski Academy. And Tom, as I understand, Allison is at large this morning. Have you sent out at APB? Yeah, you know what? Uh, she's she's somewhere. She's driving around Little Rock looking for her own school. She gets lost in the carpool line here at PA. Uh, you know, Brooklyn goes to school here. She's she's likely to drive up in the high school parking lot and totally miss us. No, she's on her way. She called me just a few moments right. ago and she says, you know, it's one thing to get up in the morning and get yourself ready for work, but when you have to get up and get your child ready to go to school with you, then you have to have a few extra minutes. But she's on her way and uh, not much going on yet. It is early and we've got a great group full of uh, kindergartners from PA that will be here a little bit later this morning. Uh, I'm sure they're probably all getting up about right now and some of them are like, well, let's go. And the others are like, no, I'm going back to bed. We're not doing that today. But Plasky Academy is the side of this morning's Breakfast with Tom and, and want to mention that uh, expecting a visit from one of our alum here at today's THV, uh, Robin Richardson. Hopefully Robin will show up this morning. We'll see if uh, in fact she does with her, her son Lowry. So let's uh, first of all get you off to what's happening weather-wise outside as uh, our readings It'll are really in cool the 70s. Off. It will eventually cool off. It has to. It's got to cool off. And if it doesn't, I'm leaving. I'm out of the state. We're going someplace else that, that's cool. All right, Charlie, we're going to check back in with you. We'll have more from PA uh, throughout the morning. Tom, did you grab some coffee before you left this morning? The Kenyan double A is spectacular. Now you, you keep teasing me. No, I have not. And, and you know what's going to happen is that whole bag will be gone before Allison and I get back. I will save a pot Just for you guys. We're, we're going to. Yeah. We're going to. A couple of coffee beans would be nice. Save us some coffee beans. That coffee courtesy of Java Primo over in Hot Springs. want to thank them. And Tom, thank you this morning. We'll be checking in sure with thing. you in just a few moments. This is today's THB This Morning. Good morning and welcome back to today's THV this morning, live from PA, Plasky Academy for breakfast with Tom, myself and Allison Courtney, not feeling herself today. Uh, she's a little unbearable. It's that, that whole allergy thing. It's, <coughs> yeah, she needs to shave too. What shave. happened to you? Now you're the bear, Tom. Yeah, the bear. I think okay. uh, you got it all mixed up. You're the unbearable one, typically. Yeah, yeah. No, we're excited about being here at PA this morning. Well, what's up with the voice? This bear greets them every morning when you come into yeah. the to main office. Does yeah, he wave? greets the kids. Uh, they say he comes alive at night. I, I don't know. Well, he's got to protect the school. Yeah, yeah. I'd That's be a good afraid idea. of a bear, actually, if I saw a bear in a window. <laughs> you might think it was alive, alive, right? Yeah. So how are you yeah. feeling? You know, that voice is coming and going again. So yeah. we'll see. This yeah. whole allergy changing of the season thing is taking its toll on me. Nothing's a lot changed. of other folks out there, I've been talking to people, they go the same thing. I'm dealing with the same thing right now. So I guess it's just going to take a little time and maybe a trip to the doctor finally. I don't know. Maybe well, what can the doctor do? Just rest like you get any of that. Yeah. 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 Well, see, yeah. Brooklyn's here. Yeah, she she yeah. made it. I'm oh, not Brooklyn. used to uh, getting myself and her ready and making right. a lunch and doing all of that. I kind of take for granted. My husband takes care of all of that, and I realize now that's that's a chore in the mornings. So. And, and he can have it, right? Yeah, Let he, him do it. He can have that. Yeah. yeah. Who, yeah. Who's your friend back there? What, what's your name? What's his name, Brooklyn? <laughs> you know? Okay. Well, fine. <laughs> Ryan. Ryan. You know, Ryan, Ryan's not from Arkansas. Okay. Uh, his mom is back there. Ryan uh -huh. is actually uh, uh, American, but he was born in Tokyo. Is that right? Yeah, they, they decided to go to school here. Very cool. At PA. They saw a great school. We're going to Arkansas to PA to go to school. We're just going to leave Tokyo. and mm -hmm. The greatest Arkansas. school in, in, yeah. in the world, yeah. Yeah. Uh, you know, coming up uh, this morning, Robin Richardson, you, you talked to her as well. Yeah, I got a text from Robin this morning about 345 because she had, called me last night and said, if you don't hear from me by 4.30, call my house phone to make sure that, that we're up. And so I got a text about 3.45 from Robin and said, now I remember why I got out of morning TV. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so but she's up and she's getting uh, Lowry and her kids ready. So they'll be here shortly. Right now, let's uh, get you up to date on what's going on in the in the weather world for some of you uh, that are up this morning getting ready to head into work or school, whatever you're doing. Uh, we had a front move through the region last night, but behind the front, it's not that much cooler yet. Point? We are uh, at 105, I believe, 105, which would put us, there is uh, 106 and two, I think we're fourth because 1980 and 1954 had 115, mm -hmm. and I can't remember what year, may have, 1998, well, anyway, we're fourth. A lot okay. of years there. Thanks for asking me that. Okay. Off. But, but I know we're in the top five. Okay. Well, we'll send things back in to Charlie for now with Amazed by Arkansas. All right, guys. Thanks so much. 
Good morning once again. Welcome back to today's CHV This Morning. Live breakfast with Tom out live at PA this morning. And it's uh, actually breakfast with uh, Tom and Allison. I don't know, since it's uh, her daughter's school. We get breakfast with Allison uh, with a special appearance by the weather guy. Right. And Andy Shock. How about that, Andy? Yeah, and the bear. And the bear. I think bear's bigger than you. Well, it's a little bit taller than I am. You ever wrestle a bear? No, I can't say that I have. Uh, you I know what? A lot of things, but a bear's not one of them. I think that the kids would love it. It'd be fun if you would wrestle the bear for them. Just well, a little entertainment value. We may have to put it on the show here in a little bit. And then. we won't put it on YouTube, as far as you know. As far as I know, right. Yeah. Just, don't, just don't check YouTube, correct? Anything out on the roads to be concerned no, with? Sir, everybody's doing a good job on their commute to work. I do have a look at your operation safe speed. Little Rock John Barrow Road, North Little Rock Curry Road, State Police I-40, north of Faulkner Lake Road, and Faulkner County is going to be on Sturgis Road this morning. So slow down in those uh, locations. Hey, I want to mention last night, Lake Hamilton and PA played a Thursday night game here. Yeah, and uh, PA hung on for, I think they, they won by uh, like 41 to 20 something, 28 something like that. Anyway, congratulations to PA. I watched about the first half of it. I know Conway favored in the Central this year. Big stuff in Faulkner County with Conway this year. Absolutely. We got a lot of good teams in Faulkner County. Every one of them. Can you name them? Well, you got Valonia, you got Mayflower, you got Greenbrier, Greenbrier. Conway, Conway yeah. Christian. Uh huh. And I hope I'm not forgetting somebody. Well, if you do, they'll let you know. Thanks, Andy. Thank you, sir. Appreciate it. Hey, once again, uh, breakfast uh, is going to be heating up here. The young ladies and gentlemen, the kindergartners here at uh, Pulaski Academy. And uh, since we're here this early and the magician guy hasn't shown up yet, Mr. Derek Rose, you've got to have the crayons. So right here, go ahead, Jerry, and show the uh, bright faces this morning that by about 1 o'clock will be begging their teacher for a nap. But, you know, we've got it covered this morning because James Stats is bringing sugar and nothing but sugar. We're going we're gonna to have sugar cubes with syrup on top for breakfast this morning, and that will keep them going for a long time. No, he, he's bringing, actually bringing some food in this morning. So uh, we're looking forward to having Mr. Stats and Mr. Derek Rose, who will do a little magic for the kiddos. Good to be here at PA. Let's get you caught up today on what's happening in the weather this morning with Plasky Skies Academy breaking. here this morning throughout the morning. Today's THV This Morning continues. Tom, we're live at PA for breakfast with Tom. Let's join them this morning and see what's going on out there. Guys, it appears that uh, traffic is picking up a bit this morning. Yeah, the kids are starting to roll in this morning. Yeah, there's a blockage out here, Napa Valley and Henson. If you're traveling this area, uh, PA uh, parents have the area blocked off with a lot of cars and kindergartners. Yeah, Slow and down. they're excited. I mean, already at 5.30 in the morning, <laughs> although around 12 or 1, I'm going to be praying for the teachers, the kindergartners, yeah, kindergarten yeah. teachers, because it's hard on those kids. They don't get naps here in kindergarten at all. So, so what are the hours like for kindergartners? Do they go till 3 o'clock? 8, 10 to 3, yeah. 10 to, yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. Well, that'll all be day. fun because you know what's going to, they'll be putting their heads down on their desks at about 1 o'clock. Yeah. There, there, will, there will be a nap whether the teachers want it or not. Somebody's taking a nap. Yeah, and then the parents will have to pick up the slack when they pick them up. It, yeah, it'll be, be all, only worse then. And they're going to be cranky. And I'm tired. We're not going to talk about that. It's going to be all yeah. fun this morning. Yeah. The kids are excited. The teachers are excited. The staff here at PA is excited. And they're excited after that big win last night over Lake Hamilton, too. Yeah, which took a little while to, uh, get, going. to get going there. It was, I went to sleep. It was about 10 after 8. It was 10 to 7, Lake Hamilton. Yeah. But then uh, PA. Apparently came myself. back and went to sleep, too. I so. would imagine uh, Coach Kelly had a few encouraging words at halftime yeah. for, his, for his group. Don't drop the football. Cut back on the penalties. And We'll do just fine. Yeah. Uh, but this morning, Plasky Academy, Derek Rose will be along. And uh, there, there's one young man here that is looking forward to seeing the magician. Oh. He didn't care about the breakfast or the right. fact that we were here with TV cameras. He right. just wanted to see the magician. Yeah. And at this age, this is where Derek is. He's excels, a good fun for the excels. kids. Yeah. So stay tuned for that. And Mr. Stats is here with uh, the sugar cubes and the syrup to put on them. In any flavor. Any, any flavor any syrup. Flavor. Yeah. Yeah, so it'll, it'll be fun. Uh, and, and what you'll see the eyes will be lighting up. Yeah. Yeah. That sugar high kicks in. Yeah. So they're going to continue to stream in uh, the doors here at PA this morning. Let's get you up to date on what's happening in weather. What time you got here? Uh, Derek Rose. <laughs> it's all at 5 30. Looks at his watch. He says yeah. right on time. Exactly. Yeah. And that's 5 30 is what we tell the kids, too. So yeah. we had a few here yeah. earlier, and now they're starting to pack the place. The, the goal is you've got about 100 kindergartens. Mm -hmm. The goal is to try to get as many of their faces on television as possible. Okay. Jerry's good at that. Yeah. He can make it happen. <laughs> He's given <laughs> us the 100 kids. Yeah. What? Yeah. Back in now to uh, Charlie with a little more information for us. Any chance Derek's going to make that bear disappear? I mean, are we going David Copperfield here? I mean, you know, David Copperfield, Copperfield can make a jet disappear. 
can wait Derek make the wait, da- bear disappear? You're comparing uh, uh, Derek Rose to David Copperfield, making the bear disappear? Hey, I have high, high optimistic expectations of Derek Rose. Derek Rose. I, I'm glad you do. <laughs> <laughs> Derek's saying yeah, so we'll see. We'll put him to the test here in a little bit. Yeah. We right. could make a kindergartner disappear. He's done that before. There you go. A bear, we a kindergartner. Yeah. Size doesn't hey, matter. Guys, thanks a lot. Time now to take